doing anything for these kids and I'm going to rally for my son and now I have to deal with my son not wanting to go to school. Now at five o'clock, a family's heartbreaking struggle with school bullying. A mother says her son, who has special needs, is being taunted and even physically assaulted. And now she is pleading with the district to put an end to the bullying, which the family said has become more and more violent. Channel 3 Eyewitness News reporter Audrey Russo has the exclusive story. Before this year, Esther Santana claims her son, Bryant Hernandez, had few problems in the classroom. But she said it all changed when he reached sixth grade this year and headed off to Wyndham Middle School. He's had anxiety attacks at school. Hernandez, she says, has special needs and an individualized education plan, or IEP. Santana says Hernandez has been getting bullied by classmates, and she claims it goes beyond schoolyard teasing. He's non-stop been getting hit from behind, knocked down. Um, then, I mean, he's had four incidents so far, and um, he got hit, punched, and he got stabbed two times with a pencil, and then the second time it was in the stomach, and that one did punch her. I'm scared to go to school because all they do is just target me every day. Santana says despite reporting it to school administrators, the bullying continues. She says discipline in her son's case has been handled internally through the school and that police have not been brought in to investigate. You're waiting for my son to get seriously hurt or end up in the hospital because you guys don't want to do nothing about it? We reached out to Wyndham Middle School principal Dr. Marcus Ware, asking him to clarify the school's bullying protocol. He declined an interview, citing student privacy concerns, but he did provide a statement, writing in part, in the rare situations when we receive allegations of such conduct, we investigate the claim immediately, properly and thoroughly, so that the rights of all students involved are fully respected. Ware went on to say, quote, we take all appropriate steps to prevent any recurrence of inappropriate conduct. What do you want to see done for your son and for other kids? <laughs> Hello, Stephanie? I just want more justice. I want them, I want, I want more discipline put down. I really do, and it's not fair. It's not fair at all. Santana tells us the school did meet with her yesterday, but she feels the meeting was more focused on her son's mental health than the bullying itself. In Willimantic, Audrey Russo, Channel 3 Eyewitness News.